for all the newbies and welcome back to the ones that are returning. We, um, first of all, the seatbelt on. It's Mother's Day weekend and happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. I hope you enjoy your day. Um, I just want to take you guys with me because this, okay. Yeah, so it's been a minute since I posted a video. My hair is so cute today. But we are, we're going to eat dinner. Something special. I had it so far on my Mother's Day. It's been going really good. Reservations at 2.30. Today is my first doctor's visit. Yeah. So, I don't know if you haven't watched the last video, go check that video out. I really gotta get me a new intro. But, as you can tell by the title of the video, I am about to have baby number seven. My boobs are big in this shirt, but they're really not. Um, <clears throat> by the time I post this video, well, yeah, by the time I post this video, my family, I already know, which I'm talking about my immediate family, my kids and, you know, everybody in the house. Um, because I have been hiding this for a while. I am 11 weeks pregnant. And I went to my doctor's appointment this morning. I actually started vlogging this morning, but my battery started dying, so I was like, um, nation, I would put you in the camera, but you got booger nose. Mama. Why are you shooting? Mama. Mm -hmm. You want me to see? All right. All right. Pop out. Pop out. <laughs> yeah, nation is terrible, okay? Nation is going into terrible twos. He's going into his terrible twos. The camera's Mama. coming. Go sit, go sit down. Um, well, anyways, I got me a good doctor. I actually went and did my reviews on this doctor, and he is so informative, and he's very, he would educate you, like, I just felt so good with this doctor, you know what I mean? And I was going to go back home and have my baby, but I'm not, so I'm going to have it here in Savannah. Yeah, he gave me, let me show y'all what he gave me before my camera dies. He told me to get, take baby aspirin because if you have been following me for a while, you should know I did have preeclampsia with Nation after birth, not during pregnancy, but after birth. But he told me to take baby aspirins until I'm like, I think he said 26 weeks or 36 weeks of pregnancy every single day with my prenatals. Um... Oh, this is for the prenatal, the Zofran for, I guess, nausea, nauseous and whatever. I only get nauseous just a little bit. Like, you know, with all my kids, I have pretty good, decent pregnancies, but we be having the headaches with this pregnancy. But I don't know if it's with the pregnancy or everybody in the house because everybody in my house has been having headaches. Back to back. I think it's something in the house. We need to get some sage. I don't know. But he gave me this booklet. He gave me this. I got this little box. Little goodie box. Baby registry. This is so cute. It says not not. So I'm kind of excited about that. So to be honest with y'all, like I'm excited that I'm pregnant, but I was really scared, and this was really a surprise, okay? Okay, so y'all know I did not tie my tubes, and I didn't tie my tubes because I feel like tying your tubes is so final. Even if you want to have another baby or don't want to have a baby, it's just final, you know? You just don't know. So I didn't tie my tubes, and, you know, he asked me about it, and I was like, I just, I think it's final. It don't matter how old I get. I don't think I want to tie my tubes, so this baby was a surprise, but you know, we always jokingly say, oh yeah, we're going to have baby number. We're going to have seven kids. It was always just something just to put out there, just to have, 
you know, it was just a thought, you know, we weren't planning it. We did not, it was, I mean, we did not mean to, I mean, you know, God has a reason for everything and, you know, every baby is a blessing. So I'm not saying, you know, I'm mad and I'm pregnant. I'm just saying that we didn't plan it. Okay. So, um, but with this baby, I'm really, really tired. I think it's, you know, with my second pregnancy, I was really, really tired. I, but this pregnancy, I have been really tired. And as far as craving, uh, I eat a lot of salads. That's what I... And I've been craving that from the beginning. Before I even found out I was pregnant, I was craving salad, salad, salad. Oh, I want a good salad. That's all I want, a good salad. So, but it really didn't dawn on me that I was pregnant. Y'all, another thing, when you're pregnant, I did not know you can't, you're not supposed to eat oysters, um, is it clams, and mussels. Y'all, I thought I was going to die before we um, found out we were pregnant. This restaurant, and y'all, it was bad. It was so bad. I, I was shaking. I was throwing up. I was pooping, TMI. I had like sweat and I was just breaking out of sweat. I don't know. It was just weird. So I do have a sonogram. I cannot, I cannot believe this. Lit Nation. This is a little baby. This is a little baby. Say baby. The heartbeat was 166, strong heartbeat. The doctor says the way the heartbeat is is good, you know. When it's lower than that, it's like kind of, you can kind of be worried for like, um, what is it? Um, miscarriage. But he told me to take, um, he told me I'm not out of the stage of it. And, you know, and I told him about my previous. Mama, what? You want to say hey? Say hey to him? What? You want to put that Vicks on your nose? Yeah, he be trying to talk. He, I think Nation is more... We're getting on to Nation on another side, another video. What, Nation? Yeah, Mama bleeding. See? Yeah. He hurt. So Y'all, when I say he messes up this house, water, water, water. <laughs> he messes up. Okay, he said war, 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 war. Thank you. <sighs> what can I say? All right, guys, I'm gonna come back. And I think my video, I think me and my husband will do another video. Say baby. Can you say baby? Look. Look. Say baby. Baby. Alright, y'all. I'm going to come back. Alright, guys.